the tune that we're going to be learning today is called Las Mañanitas and it is a traditional Mexican folk song traditionally sung on birthdays. So there you go. If you have anybody's, any family members or friends who have birthdays coming up, maybe you can play this tune for them. Um, so the tune, just a little bit about it, it is in the key of F major. And if you're at the last workshop, the tune Scarborough Fair that we worked on was in the key of D minor, which is the same key signature as F major. So we've got the one flat, B flat. And we are in three, four time in the beginning, and then we switch time signatures. That's something new that we haven't seen in a while. We switch halfway through to six, eight time. And if you're interested in taking a look at that, the sheet music is in the email that I sent earlier today and the one that I sent on Friday. You can find the folder with sheet music for all of the workshops, and that way you can see everything that's going on within the melody of this tune. All right, but let's go ahead and start off with an F scale just to make sure we're all on the same page. So again, every note is natural except for the B flat. So let's just do a one octave F major scale, starting on our low second finger F on the D string. All right, here we go. We'll do half notes. One, two, three, four. So before we get started, I will just go ahead and play the tune for you all so that you can hear it. Again, key of F major, we've got two different time signatures going on. So listen for that time change when I get halfway through the tune. See if you can pick it out. And it goes like this. and start with this first phrase. I'll go ahead and play it and then just do your best to play it back. All right, nice job everyone, looking great. So that is, as I said, the first half of the tune and then we have our time signature change where it gets a little bit faster. And again, just like in the first half, we're starting on a C, so find that note. And this first phrase goes like this. But for now, let's go ahead and go back to the very beginning of this tune. So switching gears back to three, four time, and let's try the whole thing together. So we're slowing things down. I'll count us in. And remember, we're coming in on beat three for this first section. We've got two pickup notes. And actually, just to kind of give you a little reminder, because sometimes it's hard to just switch time signatures, I'll go ahead and just play this first little section. So if we're counting in three, one, two, three, one, two. So that's the feel that we're going for, okay? So here we go. Everyone ready? One, two, three, one, two. And there we go. Yay, give yourselves a round of applause. That was not an easy tune, probably one of the harder ones that we've done during workshop. So congratulations for sticking it out all the way till the end. Um, and if you didn't quite get every single note or every single rhythm in the tune, now you'll have something to go practice and work on and, and see if you can figure out those last few things. But I hope you enjoyed learning Las Mañanitas and um, are able to play it just for fun, practice it, work on it, and, and see what you can um, 
you can do with it just on your own, playing around with it. Does anybody have any last questions, thoughts before we go? Looks like we're all good. Awesome. Well, I hope you'll join me in the next workshop, which is going to be April 23rd. So not the last Sunday of April, but the second to last Sunday. It's a little bit different than what we usually do. So mark your calendars for that April 23rd at the same time, 7 p.m. Central, 8 p.m. Eastern. And then the next workshop after that in May, we're going to have a special type of workshop where it's going to be sort of a play along style jam workshop. So less of the workshop part, more of just the play along jam session type feel. So we're going to go through uh, several tunes, just playing them at a slower tempo to start so that you can just get used to playing along for those of you who are wanting to go to jam sessions, but maybe aren't quite comfortable yet playing with other people. This is a really great way to practice getting into that. Um, so I encourage you to come to that. Like I said, first half will be on the slower side and then we'll take those sec those same tunes in the second half and play them at a slightly faster tempo just so that you can get an idea of how that will be. And that is May 14th. So mark your calendars for that as well. And that will be the only workshop in May is that play along style one. So April 23rd and then May 14th. So I hope to see you guys soon. Thanks so much for being here. Have a great night. Bye.